The Georgetown window is a great high-end energy efficient window for more of the cost conscious consumer. Let's take a look at the Georgetown window. The exterior profile is still a European contoured cold molding exterior finish. That European contoured cold molding exterior finish of the frame has got a nice soft rounded edge to the sash and that sash has a nice soft transition to the glass making a nice clean cut all the way throughout. The European contoured cold molding exterior of our frame has a nice beautiful traditional window look with some new age technology and design. It's got a nice soft frame to sash transition and sash to glass transition, which gives you a beautiful clean look all the way throughout. A dual durometer exterior glaze bead product means it's two different types of vinyl, one hard and one soft, creating a nice traditional seal all the way throughout the outside of the window. The Georgetown window has two screens available. One is our traditional standard half screen extruded aluminum screen frame, which is side spring loaded, has a traditional spline system, and is available in our standard Viclear fiberglass mesh. And the other is a full screen flex screen. It's a spring steel frame all the way on the exterior. Powder coated, the same powder coating that is used for picnic benches, picnic tables, and exterior furniture. It's flexible in nature for easy use to be able to get in and out of the window frame. It is actually welded to that exterior frame on a traditional 85 United inch window. Flex screen offers you significantly more viewing space to the outside. Whereas your traditional aluminum screen blocks off significant view from the outside, flex screen gives us the ability to hide into the screen channel, giving us more view of the outside world. Flex screen also offers a few other features and benefits. There is a warning label affixed to every flex screen. This warning label says, and I quote, screen will not stop child from falling out of window. Keep child away from open window. This screen label protects you, our customer, as well as your customer and allows them to know that the screen will not stop a child from falling through. As a matter of fact, the American Safety Council says that the only proper way to ventilate your windows on the second story and up is to ventilate from the top sash down. The only way to ventilate from the top sash down and stop the intrusion of bugs into your home is by having a full screen. Flex screen is the first full screen in the vinyl replacement window industry that allows you to have that full screen, but also gives you the ability to take the screen in and out with ease. The actual screen material itself is a fiberglass high definition screen material. It is black in color. The holes are 30% smaller than traditional screen holes. The high definition screen mesh when paired with a window with low E coating as well as being out in natural light, basically disappears to the human eye. So when you look outside and you wanna see a green grass, you will see the greenest grass and bluest skies currently in the industry today. The screen material itself has a hydrophobic coating on it. This hydrophobic coating means it repels water. Whereas traditional window screens have a tendency to have all of the outside sediments, dust, dust mites, pollen, build up on the window and gunk up in all of the corners of all of the screens. This hydrophobic coating means that the water, whenever water is placed, it helps repel all of those outside sediments, keeping your screen clean and a beautiful view to the outside. Because of this hydrophobic coating, even though that you can take the screen in and out with ease, this screen is designed to never be taken out of the window and be able to be used year round. No feature of any window is as critical to outstanding air and water performance as is the sill design. The bottom of the window is the most important part when trying to keep air and water from coming into your home. The Georgetown window has a traditional slope sill design. This slope sill design allows us to allow water 
to weep its way towards the outside of the window and outside of the home, keeping water away from the inside of the home where it's meant to be. Inch and a quarter designed to a five degree slope sill. Why a five degree slope sill? It's the optimum amount of slope for water runoff and air infiltration stoppage. Inch and a quarter pocket to a five degree slope sill. Why a five degree slope sill? It's the optimum amount of slope for water runoff and air infiltration stoppage. We have a bottom sash structural interlock leg built into our mainframe, which allows our sash to straddle that structural interlock leg and locks that sash into place during heavy wind loads so our sash has nowhere to go. A Q-Long based gasket weather stripping, which is the same weather stripping used in refrigerators and freezers. It's a foam based weather stripping with a vinyl covering that can change shape, but goes back to its original shape, is the best defense against drafts and air from coming into your home. That same type of technology and weather stripping is designed on our sash and straddles and compresses on the mainframe, which stops most air from coming into your home. There's no such thing as a 100% airtight window. However, the Georgetown window is one of the most energy efficient windows at keeping air from forcing its way in. And this is one of the key components to that. As I grab my ergonomically designed integrated lift rail, ergonomically designed for easy fingertip control, integrated into the sash so it's not a snap-on part. Snap-on parts, as we know, have a tendency to snap off. I get a buttery smooth operation of the sash both up and down. How am I able to achieve the buttery smoothness of the sash both up and down? By my Teflon coated stainless steel, heavy duty, constant force balance system known as the Viglide. The Viglide is a half inch balance system, which is a little bit thicker than most constant force balance system for better weight control. It's Teflon coated. Teflon coated products are most commonly used in pots and pans, which means it's a non-sticky material, i.e. buttery, so it has a non-stick control and easy control for homeowners up and down. It's stainless steel. Stainless steel is the least conductors of all metals, and it's also not going to rust or corrode like other metals. It's housed in my thermally engineered housing unit, which is going to keep my coil clean and work very similar as a tape measure. And it's also going to have what's called an closed shoe technology. Most constant force balance systems has what's called an open shoe technology, where when you take the sash to a 90 degree angle, the sash is designed to pop out or attack the homeowner. Our closed shoe design technology allows us to operate our sashes both up and down and tilt them all the way in for easy cleaning without the sash popping out or attacking us. A traditional window has a single fin or no fin weather stripping. On the Georgetown window, we use a triple fin weather stripping. The more fins you have, the more bears diversions you create. The more bears diversions you create, the tougher it is for air and water to come into your home. On a traditional double hung window that's 32 wide by 53 tall, a traditional Energy Star certified product will use about 200 inches of weather stripping. On a traditional Georgetown window that's 32 inches wide by 53 inches tall, we use over 350 inches of weather stripping, all triple fin, almost double the amount of weather stripping a traditional Energy Star certified product would have. Not only that, our weather stripping is a silver based antimicrobial coating on it. Dust, mold, mildew, dust mites, pollen and bacteria are all things that I call allergy triggers. Allergy triggers love to build up on damp, wet spaces. On a wall with windows, the dampest, wettest space is generally the weather stripping on a window. By having a silver-based antibacterial protectant on it, it helps prevent the mold, mildew, dust mites, pollen, and bacteria from building up on my window and coming to my home, creating a healthier living environment for you and your family. Full length meeting rail interlock allows the sashes to interlock with one another, creating better air infiltration as well as stronger for structural strength and security so nobody can get to the windows from the outside. Our progressive cam action lock is a strong progressive cam action lock. So as it goes to lock, it's grabbing that sash and progressively getting stronger and thicker, creating a nice tight seal. Our low profile captured tilt latches have a nice rounded aesthetic appeal and are low profile in nature, so they're not desk collectors or fingernail breakers as they're ergonomically designed for easy fingertip control. 
Our vent stops are designed to stop travel of the sash from the bottom to the top or from the top down to stop children from tampering. AMA and NFRC are the two third-party independent testing companies in the window industry. AMA, the American Architectural Manufacturers Association, do three main tests, air infiltration, water penetration, and structural strength. NFRC does the thermal ratings, a U-factor, solar heat gain coefficient, and visible transmittance. The air infiltration rating of this window is a 0 0.09 air infiltration. To be an Energy Star certified product, you have to have an air infiltration rating of 0 0.30 CFMs or lower to pass our test. With an air infiltration rating of 0 0.09, it means the Georgetown window is more than three times energy efficient than most Energy Star certified products out there today. The water and structural rating on the Georgetown window is an R35, meaning we pass more than 135 miles an hour wind before something structurally breaks making the Georgetown window a high performing product. The Georgetown window has a standard double pane low e fact, U factor of 0.28 with a solar heat gain coefficient of 0.33, making it Energy Star certified anywhere in the northern half of the country. The Georgetown window can come standard with a triple silver low E, which would make it Energy Star certified for the southern half of our country as well.